Thank you for joining me here today in the Visitor Information Center at the Crater of Diamonds State Park. We're going to find out how many diamonds have been found and how big they were and uh, just a little bit of exciting news. A perfect, beautiful, spotless, clean 99 point white diamond was found by David Anderson and you will see that picture here. On uh, Saturday, April 29th, David Anderson registered a 99 point white. That tells about it but the picture's not up yet. It will be in a minute. It only costs $13 for adults ages 13 and up to search for diamonds all day. On Saturday, April 29th, uh, David Anderson also registered a three-point white diamond. So he dug a hole, dug 60 buckets. Oh, there's that 99-point white. It's perfect. In 60 buckets, he found one three-point white diamond and was discouraged until the last Saruka he flipped had that 99 point white in it and then he knew it was well worth digging those and washing those 60 buckets. On uh, April 29th a visitor from Murfreesboro, Arkansas registered a 13 point white diamond. There was a picture of a 13 point white when I was saying that. On Sunday, April 30th, the visitor from Battleground, Washington registered a two-point white diamond. Now, there are 100 points of weight per carat, so that's 1 50th of a carat. And that 99-pointer was just almost a full carat. There it is, 99 white, beautiful. On Sunday, April 30th, a visitor from Nashville, Arkansas registered a seven-point white diamond. That's a pretty one point. On Sunday, April 30th, visitor from Piercy, Arkansas registered a 19 point white diamond. There's a 19 point white. On Sunday, April 30th, the visitor from Nashville, Arkansas registered a 13 point white diamond. There's a pretty 2.10 carat brown. That's a birthday diamond woman from Gentry, Arkansas, that's Northwest Arkansas found it. On, well, I missed that one, but it was a 10 point <laughs> brown, 10 point brown. There's a 10 point brown up there at the right. That one point brown, a uh, white, looks like the 99 point white, but uh, it's 99 times smaller. On uh, Sunday, April 30th, a visitor from Battleground, Washington registered a one-point white diamond. 329 diamonds have been found so far this year as of April 30th. That's a pretty good start. 35,472 diamonds have been found at this site by visitors since it became a state park. 51 years ago in 1972. So here's that 99 point white I already told you about and there's another diamond or two I told you about but I missed missed one because I was uh, yakking about other things while telling about David finding only a three point white in 60 buckets and then turned up a 99 point white on his last Saruka flip. He had about gotten disgusted and discouraged but uh, there it was you never know when and where a diamond's going to show up so on april 29th a visitor from raymore missouri registered a 46 point yellow diamond that's almost a half carat and raymore is almost a suburb of kansas city missouri area so that's north of here about 450 miles on saturday april 29th the visitor from murfreesboro registered a 12 point white so I think I told you about that one, and I think I told you about all the diamonds so far. So uh, thanks for joining me for this latest update from Arkansas's Crater of Diamonds State Park. Keep checking back and uh, like our videos and subscribe, and then you'll get all the latest news about the diamond finds here. Thank you.